Hey guys, thanks so much for stopping by. So today I'm going to do a book review and this is entitled Rogue Writer. This is a book number four of the Lords of the Deliverance series. Um, and this is rated 4.38 out of 5 stars at goodreads.com. So um, I will give you information from Goodreads and then we're going to go from there. Um, this is, it says here, the prophecies were there but no one listened until now. They are the Lords of Deliverance and they have the power to ward off Doomsday or let it ride. Jillian Cardiff came to this remote mountain town to forget the demon attack that almost killed her. She rescues a gorgeous stranger who has no memory of anything other than his name. Um, this was first published back in November 20, 2012, and the genres are blowing to be paranormal romance, paranormal demons, angels, fantasy, and romance. Um, this is written by Larissa Ioni. So, um, I would suggest first and foremost to please, 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 please read the first three books. If you read this first, I believe your journey for how Larissa wanted you to enjoy the series is really going to be ruined. So please don't break that. Um, once you get into this book, if you have never read this series or even the Demonica series, um, I apologize, there's going to be a little bit of spoiler, but I can't help myself. But if you have already read um, this series and you haven't read this one, this is, of course, about the fourth um, horseman. Because one, two, three, four. And this is book number four, right? Um, so, just so you know, this I never really expected to like this book at all. Because in the previous books, even in the, in the Demonica series, this was the character that I really detested the most. I actually even hated him. Um, but this is a book really of like his great redemption in which... I, I wanted to say something and I'm like, oh, it's probably going to be like a spoiler from the previous book. And of course this one too. Oh. But, um, oh my god, I totally fell in love with the rest of here. Just, just, oh my god. Um, I'm not going to go into a lot of details just because it's very sweet and short in goodreads.com and I usually like that kind of synopsis there just because there's really not a lot of spoilers. It's very, it's, it's just, it, that's it. Um, I believe this is also the first time that I have ever read this information because uh, I was reading it um, back to back, um, the, the series. Sometimes I do that, but sometimes when a series is like over 10, sometimes I take a break and I read something else. Uh, but this one is only four, so I managed to, and I was incredibly just hooked on the series. I couldn't really stop reading. And I'm so, so glad that this, this was uh, first published back in November 20th, 2012 because if I was reading the series in 2010, excuse me, and this book wasn't even published, I think I'd go out of my mind. Like, I'm like, oh my God, I want to know what's going to happen. Um, this book really made me super giddy and um showed a completely different person when it comes to the horseman um i think that was already a spoiler so i do apologize for that um but anyway it really is worth a read i encourage everybody to read all the time and um I feel like romance books are always such a delicious treat and um, sometimes I feel for like a paranormal romance like this and sometimes I just feel for like a new adult or contemporary or young adult, you know, you know what I mean? Like a variety of things but there has to have romance in there. This is definitely action and this you definitely get to feel like I felt like my heart was breaking reading this book. It, it There's just certain moments that I'm like, oh no, really, no. Um, deliciously hard read. 
uh, enjoyed every single minute of it. And actually, I am currently in, in, you know, I'm currently reading a book. I'm almost done with that. And when I'm done, I think I'm probably going to pick this up again. Just I'm probably going to read it again just because I read this book multiple times. That's a for sure. And that's why, like... I don't know it just it's one of those it's just one of those like I just finished the book right like I just finished it like last week or less than a week ago or some and of course I'm reading a different book and I'm like oh my god I want to read it again <laughs> it is a such a delicious read you're not gonna be disappointed but again I do suggest you read the um the series you know um how you're supposed to read it in order as well as I would also suggest you go to the Demonica series first and then this one just because that one was first and it does build up to this spinoff um, um so I'm gonna rate this and I'm gonna give this a two thumbs up and drum roll so I'm gonna give this a 10 star rating I love this book so much just like it makes me sigh all the time when I'm thinking about it, when I'm reading it, when I am just like, just, oh my God, like, so, um, yes, 10 star rating, two thumbs up. Yes, I definitely recommend this book 100%. I actually recommend the whole series and of course I recommend the Demonica series as well. Don't worry, all that info and where you can get them, it will be down below. So don't worry about any of that. I always do that for you guys so that it's easy for you guys to check it out. If you have any suggestions, if you want to chat about the book or suggestions and advice on certain books that you believe I probably will enjoy to read, let me know down below because I love reading that. Um, again, I would like to stress out I would only want to read books that have romance in them if you guys send me books that have zero romance in them i'm probably not gonna pick that up so um you can still send it to me my address is down below but just letting you know the chances of me picking that up might be very very slim um so thanks guys and i'll see you guys again next time bye Thank you so much for watching my video. Please uh, hit the like button, subscribe button, and the bell so you'll be notified whenever I do upload a new video. Don't forget to expand the description box because as much as possible, I always try to get coupons for you guys, discount codes, and other goodies uh, like that. Um, I also have my Twitter information, Instagram, Snapchat, and for business increase, I have my email there as well. Thank you guys, and I'll see you again next time. Bye.